Building A fortress And we thought We thought it was stronger Keeping Your distance I thought I thought we were better We can try to hide from the pain By building our castle and welcome back to another video finally it's been a while we took a short break from uh, making videos for about two weeks just to enjoy the holidays with our family and chill and sort of refresh for the new year I know every youtuber has said this in the last video I've seen them say it but really it's true it's just nice to get away and then like re-spark your creativity or whatever so anyway <laughs> While I was away, the Zara sale started and you guys know me, you know that I love Zara and I just went absolutely mad this time in the Zara sale. If you follow me on Instagram then you will have seen in my stories that I got an insane amount of Zara boxes um, in the last week. So I think I'm going to divide this up, well I know, I'm going to divide this up into two separate hauls and this one is going to be the first one. So um, you saw in the intro lookbook part of the video the items that I got and now I'm just going to talk to you about them and tell you sort of, I don't know, why I chose them or whatever. This is what people do when they do Zara hauls. So yeah, let's talk about the items that I picked up. And of course, I have to do my quick little insert. If you are new here, hello and welcome. My name is Kirsty. I upload two fashion related videos a week and I would love it if you would hit the subscribe button down below. Okay, now are you ready? Because I feel ready. I had to mentally prepare myself for this because um, it's so much. I'll start with the first item and that is a red biker jacket and if you guys watch my channel then you have seen my black biker jacket that I bought a few months ago from Zara and this is actually exactly the same jacket only in red. So I thought it would be cool because I don't have a red jacket and yeah I just really I like the idea of a red biker jacket and I really like the color on this because it's not too it's not too bright I wanted something that was a little bit darker and let's be honest I was basically just going mad seeing the prices and just clicking order on everything that was marked down ridiculously this jacket used to be 50 euro I picked it up for 29.95 so I got 20 bucks off almost 50% great deal and I really love this jacket and I already knew I was gonna like the fit because I have it in black as well the red jacket I ordered online but of course I couldn't help myself I also went in store and I picked up two things in store actually um, three things but I'll talk about the third thing next week because yeah <laughs> otherwise it's gonna be too much so I've been eyeing this sweater for a really long time and I think it was 40 euro and 
I personally find 40 euro a lot to spend on knitwear so I don't really go mad buying sweaters at Zara when they're not on sale however when they go on sale I like to buy a couple because who doesn't like sweaters I love sweaters and I had been eyeing this one for a while I really like the contrast of the cream or sort of oatmeal color with the black trimming it's got it along the sleeve as well and then what I really love about this is that it is a wide sleeve but it cinches at the wrist with a little black tie so really love this really love the fit of this and also it's not too long so yeah that's basically why I chose the sweater and why I really love it and it was 40 euro and the price tag said 29.95 and don't you just love this when this happens I got to the till and it was only 19 euro 95 so of course I was super excited about that at the time next thing I picked up in store was just a little long sleeve top and I picked this up because I was looking for items that have blush color in them because I don't really have anything that's blush colored and this one has a blush a gray a white and a black stripe in it and I love the color combination of this because you can combine it with gray items with black items with white items I just think this is a very versatile top and it was 15 euro 95 and I picked it up for 7 euro 95 so half off great deal Next thing I'll talk about is two puffer jackets that I picked up. I have been looking for my perfect puffer jacket for a while now and I knew I wanted to wait until the sale because really the cold weather is now January and February and the puffer jackets are all or a lot of them are on sale right now um, so I picked up two and I went for this white one which is more on the pricey side it's a high necked um, longer uh, puffer jacket and it is 100% um, down so it's real feathers inside I really love the idea of a white jacket I just think it's uh, something that's a little bit different because I think most people will go safe and like buy a black one or maybe a dark green one which I also picked up by the way but um, when I received this and I put it on I thought this is so cool and different and I really like it and plus white is kind of really on trend right now more white booties I think but also I guess white in general so I'm really glad that I picked this up it was 99 euro 95 and I got it for 79.95 but here is a little Zara sale trick in the Netherlands you can pay after you've received your order so right now this jacket is back in stock and it has been marked down again to 59 euro 95 so I am going to reorder it and return this one because who doesn't want to pay 20 euro less for a jacket so I guess that's sort of a Zara sale shopping tip just keep an eye out um, every Thursday things will be marked down uh, more not all things on sale but they will mark down a certain sort of array of things more so I already said I picked up another puffer jacket and I was this green one and the reason the main reason I picked this up was because I could not let it pass for that price it was marked down to I think 20 euro and it was 60 so that is a huge markdown so of course I picked it up I really like the length of this one it's a lot longer than the white one and but it's also a lot puffier because I think it's Oh, I know it's from the TRF collection so it's a little bit more on the edgy side but I really do like this the quality of this one is not as good as the other one the zipper kind of gets stuck and the fabric goes into the zipper so I might end up returning this one just because I don't want to even if it's only 20 euro I don't want to spend it on a jacket that's gonna annoy me because I can't zip it up properly if you know what I mean so yeah and I also like that the other one is a bit higher quality but I do really love this one and I do recommend it if it's still available in your country okay so let's move on to some of the accessories that I picked up you saw them styled in the lookbook part at the beginning of the video the first one I will talk about is this oversized knitted beanie I got this in three colors I don't really like the other two colors so I will return them that's why I'm only show you guys this one it's really an oversized knit it sits a little bit like odd on your head because it's so wide I'll show you guys I'll show you guys it's just 
because it's such a chunky knit it goes really wide around your head um, but I don't mind the look of that especially on this one the black one seemed to look wider on my head I don't know why and then I got it in yellow as well which was the same fit the same way as this one it's just not a color that I think I'll wear a lot so I decided to keep the gray one which by the way it was 15 euro and I got it for 10 but it's only like six or four euro now so um, maybe I'll do my little Houdini trick again and return this one and then get the cheaper one I probably will because let's be honest last sale item I picked up is something that I have been wanting for so long I've been eyeing them and they were 90 euro and it is or they are these leather boots they are knee high they've got a heel a rounded toe and they've got this really cool uh, metal detail on the back I really love these these were immediately out of stock I couldn't get my hands on them but what I do another Zara sale trick is I will bookmark a page for an item that is sold out and I'll also tell you guys the sold out items won't be listed on the website anymore but you can go to another country's Zara and then see if the item is still there and then in the URL bar you can change the country from uh, en which is England it will say first the country en and then slash then the language so en or es if you are Spanish or whatever and uh, but the first one is the country so you can if you put it on English then you can change the uh, country code to yours if you know what it is mine is NL England would be EN, uh, US would be just US and I think Spain is ES and then France is FR anyway you get the gist of it and then you can change it to your country site and you'll get you'll get to the page of the item that is sold out and what I do is I bookmark that page of the item that's sold out and then every now and again I will just click on it and that was the case for these boots they came back in stock in size 38 which unfortunately is not my size but sometimes they fit so I thought why the hell not I'll try so I ordered them they are a little bit snug on my foot so I have rebookmarked the page and I'm hoping praying that size 39 comes back in stock but uh, in the meantime uh, I think I'll, I don't know what I'm gonna do yet I might return these I might sell them online or I might keep them I really don't know yet because I'm so in love with these boots but yeah it doesn't help if they're not very comfortable so they're a little bit slightly too small they pinch off my toes um, anyway that was a whole long babble story I love these boots unfortunately they don't fit me they were 90 euro and I got them for 50 but right now they are 40 euros and then I could not resist I picked up two items from the new arrivals section but they aren't really new arrivals because I've been eyeing them for a while and I they're not really that expensive so I thought why not just pick them up so I'm gonna show you guys <laughs> I picked up this corduroy baker boy hat you guys if you follow me on Instagram you've seen me in store put on this hat a million times I don't know why I hadn't purchased it yet um, I have a leather one as well that I got for Christmas from my sister but I decided to just pick this one up as well and it is 15 euro 95 it actually comes in two sizes so look out for that because I had a medium on in store first and it was really wide and then I found a small and it looked a lot better so just just so you know it's not a one-size-fits-all type of a thing and then finally the pierce de resistance or however you say that I picked up this fanny pack that's such a weird word okay I picked up this fanny pack from Zara that I've been eyeing uh, for quite a while and it was sold out and then it came back in stop in stop in stock so I ordered it immediately I really love this this is my favorite item that I picked up even though it's not a sale item it's just so flippin awesome and it looks so stylish and I am so over the moon with this purchase so it's just this little handbag and it's got these lions heads on the front and it's got um, matte gold um, hardware on it on this and then there's also a strap so you can carry it as a shoulder bag and this one has also got matte gold hardware on it but I will be definitely wearing this as a fanny pack so it comes with this leather strap not leather it's faux leather and you can detach this and then obviously attach the other one um, but it goes through two loopholes and then you can just wrap it around and 
click it in and then you have a fanny pack which is super awesome i love this um so yeah those are all the items that I'm going to show you guys this week. Next week, I'll have another Zara sale haul with the rest of the stuff that I picked up. So stay tuned for that. I hope you guys really like this video and I'm so glad to be back and to be talking to you again. If you like this video, then give it a like down below and comment to me what uh, jacket you prefer, which of the puffer jackets, because you've obviously seen them on me now. So what are your thoughts on it? I'm leaning more towards the white one, but I would love to get your input on that. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.